So, Craig, we come full circle today. Why? Well, who's the biggest Me? ball breaker when it comes to making a mistake and then putting it on Snap World, whatever it is? Me. Okay. Today, yeah. we are working with a thousand dollar unit that you destroyed. Tell us how you destroyed it. We're putting in a temp tank that you dented. I did. Tell us about it. It was about two years ago. Oh, I don't think it was that long. We got forks for a... You're gonna put down the equipment? No, and then my dad bent the one My dad, all right. So they're not straight, so they go Or like the install, no. It's the bucket was crooked. No, the forks are crooked. Yeah, because it, because it bent them, attaches on. Like they're like this, so I have to try and put that through a pallet with a tank. 30 feet in the air, and I pushed one off. Two off. Well, they're attached to the strap. Right, too, so that was $2,000. Right. And it fell over. I think we may have the clip. Oh, yeah. Johnny, go to the clip. Do you have a video? I think so. Yeah. So that's good. Today will be fun. Today will be fun. Right, Mike? You're like Larry, he's a good dude, you just can't shut him up. So you want to go together and find that dented tank? Come on, follow me up. <laughs> 275s. You, you found it? Oh Lord, look at that. Sam, I think there's one worse than that, isn't there? Yeah, there's two. There's two. One is worse than the other, though, right? Mike, we're bringing down the broken tank Craig did. Mr. Superstar. He broke it. Cameron, we'll see how he edits out the fact that he, bent, he broke the uh, forks. I didn't bend the forks. They went on crooked. Had I bend them? No, they go on the thing crooked. You do know that. Look at this setup. Push the button, Sam. Well, we get somebody to fix that. Heads up, Mike. Broken tank. Oh, look at that dent down there. Oh, good job, Craig. Thanks, guys. Way to go. Hey, all day. <laughs> I'll show him the one where you were pulling the muck truck out. Last time we ever left Bry Wheelbarrow. Last time. It's always good when a man takes accountability. What happened, Craig? It's just unacceptable behavior. What happened? Well, I tried to dump it. A little too confident. Confidence? A little speed. Too spewing speed. A little wet dirt. Didn't didn't flow out the way All I right. thought. It smells like we're, we're creating an environmental impact. I smell fuel oil. All right, jump Are in. Are we ready to chain that out now? We're ready. Okay. I'm actually a little embarrassed bringing this. I'm gonna paint this gray. Wait, shouldn't we have put? I need mean, a gauge for it. No, I meant um, dope. It's a temporary thing. We put that over here. Yep. And then that's where I said two plugs. Uh, usually we put it here next to this, but it doesn't. We don't have just a sight gauge. I thought we did. I think we do. No. Correct.
Yeah, it's got 12 inches. That's what I'm saying. We should have brought the pads today and set that all up for us. So when we come in... Then we wouldn't need to do a temp tank if we were doing all that. Well, yeah, we would. There's only one window, I'm being told, to the basement. And that's just going right outside. I don't know if that... Why wouldn't we just well, install the tank? If we were just doing our ends, bringing the pad, we need to do our... Are the pads near the excavation? He's got to have to have a remediation. He's got 12 inches of water. I don't know that. Right, so that's why you go prepared on just installing this temp tank right outside of a basement window. This way you know today will be successful and the temp tank won't be in the way on the removal or the remediation. I asked you that yesterday, you said you don't know anything about the job. I normally don't. Or today I just may feel creative and coming up with a good lie. I don't know, Craig. What do I know? Not much. I'm just the owner. We're not, we're just not doping anything, are we? Huh? Yeah, we should have done the fill. Yeah, right, Craig? So why don't you go over there and look? I didn't do everything. I'll go look. You want to clean? No. I'll clean it. I'll clean it. I ain't scared of, of a little elbow work. Can you reach the tank? Yeah, I got it. Oh, where's the frisbee? Throwing, you guys throwing it on the roof. Wait, where's the frisbee? That's how, that's the game. In your truck. Where? In your truck. As I get it right Okay, inside. big truck. Trunk? Trunk, I said. Okay, ready, Mike? Yeah. I'm not going you can't to. go beyond this. Yeah. Right here. Got to hit the wooden door. Hit the wooden door. I can't even reach the wooden Matt, door. to end this game, right off the bat, we're furthest from the water door. But we won't, we won't. We'll give see people a practice. Has he started his bitching yet? You Can you reach that? What is it? It's probably... I'm going to say that's 40 yards, 120 feet. Right there. Hey, not, no? 120 feet. I, as long as I throw it, I was 20 feet short. You didn't throw it good. My right, my left elbow hurts. That's, that's catch with my son all my life right there. It came out, Craig. It's a bad day for you. We're talking about you breaking tanks, people, falling on the frisbee. When people hear that, they're just thinking, wow, I can't believe he grew up with that guy. Yeah, no, what I said last week, what an a-hole. Huh? Sam, can you reach that door? Oh, I can't. I can't, Mike, give me. That's Craig's spot. You go. <laughs> go ahead, Mike. Craig, why don't you stay down there? Alright, here's the question. I have to let go of it before the line, but can I cross Correct. as I'm Of course falling? you can, of course you can. Huh. Really? Because my stomach will be across. It may roll and hit it. It may roll and hit it. If that rolled and hit it, I would have gave it to you. What? Sam? You can reach that, can't you? These guys just don't know how to throw. Sam can throw a frisbee. First thing these kids don't know is about is preparation. You've got to clear your landing path here. You need your footing on this. Father's Day is going to be fun. Chasing our crap all day. No, not at all. Give me. Get there. Yes. Nice. Yes. I think that may have hit center. In the Sylvie. Right on top. Dented my car, my truck. Hey, let's hear it for daddy. Dad, father. You have an extra attack. Hey, so there's three. There's eight there, so somebody gets two, two, and three. 
good. Let's hear it for me. Congratulations. I am winning Father's Day's froth. You are. All right. We're live. Okay, here we are. So this gentleman called us for a bid to remove his 1,000 gallon underground tank which that's his vent pipe so it runs this way probably runs to right about here and install two above ground tanks now the problem is about a month ago that filled up has 12 inches of water in it guys had no heat uh, no hot water excuse me so we're just installing a temp tank today I'm gonna put it right there gonna put the suction line right through the window because we are about six weeks backed up so I'll rent him that tank that's why he's getting Craig's damage tank see that's me I um I turn lemons into lemonade kids that's what I do Craig what are you working on drop tube, drop tube? are we officially taking the coating off yep you are Mike or is he lying I have not I you have not. I have not. Tell the folks why, after 18 years, you've learned that we have to take the coating off. I'm going to say, who's this guy? Five years. Six years. Who made that Five shirt? years? What, that's bull, bull crap. You were amazed the other day when we pulled it out. And yeah, it, but how long have we been using coated copper? Oh, okay. You're, getting, you're doing a technicality. Okay. But you never knew that, though. I did not. So tell the folks what was happening. Uh, the oil was getting between the copper oh, and the water. Right, so this sat down in the oil. Yeah. So the other day we pulled the old one out and the whole sleeve had was slid off, which was actually hitting the bottom of the tank, making it more difficult to draw the fuel, which means 250 times 200, 400, um, say 600 tanks a year. Yeah. We have almost 9,000 tanks out there with the coating slipping off of it. Does that worry you, Sam? Yes. Me too. How much is in there? Oh, you, are you going to stick it? I did Dude, you, you took that excitement away from the folks. Mike. Go. See, I know. I'm not, my guys, I'm not patient. Today is, is Father patient. Master POV. You guys know POV from porn. Look at the dirty looks as you... You guys are slobs, oh, man. A, uh, you didn't learn that at my house. That's a gaming term. Yeah. POV is a gaming term? Yeah. Point of view. Point of view. Oh, I thought it was a porn term. Yeah. <laughs> whatever you, you put it in. Whatever, whatever, whatever whose head is that in? Wow. Whatever you Whoa, want hey, hey, hey. Yeah, well, you looked at me like you you were thinking that. Because I know your brain. Oh, okay. <laughs> Am I ever right with never. anything? No. no. Thank no. God you've seen it now. All right. Jeez. Except for running a successful business for 20 years. That I'm right about. Or that's not me either. No, it's not. Hey, the question is, when the homeowner comes out, do I still keep this thing on my freaking head? He'll have a comment. He's a little sarcastic. It, He'll say something. Which is funny. Hey, I don't really... Cross -eyed. I don't... <laughs> I'll wear it, baby. You will? Can you not show my, my boobs and yeah. fat body? If you can pull that off. I see much work getting done on this. Yeah, I know. Time. That's true. Good point. <laughs> you see me walking back and forth. Uh, right constant. Taking orders. Hey, you know, that would be here? great because we could watch a whole point of view and say, wow, we treat him like crap. Yeah. Because <laughs> you could see his point of view the whole day. <laughs> hey, let's bring the tank out and see what it looks like over there. I think me and Sam could carry the 30 gallons of it. I don't want to. Who? Me and Sam. Carry? While it's in the tank. No way. Well, it's 6.7 pounds per gallon, so that's 100, it's going to be over 200 pounds, and it's 500 pounds. Uh, no, that's bad math. How is that bad math? What's the weight of oil? Six pounds is water. For six pounds a gallon, I think. Is water? Pretty sure. Okay, but six times 30 is what? 180. 180. And, it's, and it's a 300 pound tank. 480. 500 pounds. 250, 250. Yeah. Wait, let's back it up to that. where I was criticized by saying that's terrible math. Yeah, because we're talking about the weight of the oil, not the whole thing. Well, we're talking about him. He's asking if he can lift it up. It's it. 500 pounds. 
Say you're sorry, Mr. Superstar. Let's try it. We have handles. I want to see how these work. So does Kay Jesperson, who won Wait, yeah, the ahead. double hoodie challenge. So now we What's can Kay's put first name. We can put the oil in it. I don't know. I don't know Kay's first name. Let's see how this works. No, they're amazing. Dude. They, they on, are. On ASC removals, this is amazing. I'd rather just cut it in half. Yeah, okay. It's the same guy that was picking up uh, mats. Yeah. No, like no. this? Yep. Yeah, that's it. No. <laughs> that's the one. <laughs> huh. It's the same thing that you put on me that one He's not going to put day. any of this on the video because it's too much bickering. Let, let people see what I have to deal with. You. You. Yeah. So how Drop, I that. Drop that. Drop <laughs> that. Okay. Now, because I'm so short. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ever done a belt before? Hey, Jammer's going to an event where he has to wear a, a, a tux, and for the first time, he doesn't have to wear fat man suspenders. Oh, man. <laughs> Dude, wait till wait the next time you go to an amusement park, and you don't have to check with the fat man that's with the fat ride the fat seat that's outside the entrance <laughs> you know you ever see them yes to do a quick run see, in i do this i cross it behind my neck because it's too long because i like it a little that higher sucks. look at the long results <laughs> really go okay now what of what this just goes under it, it goes, goes under my under. yeah but you can't balance it yeah, you, do. you balance it like this yeah, actually if you go from one leg to the other like no, right dead center yeah but it's going to slide off that no Okay. We've well, done this 300 times. So let's do it. Okay. Take that off. You're going to do it? Take that off. Yeah. Oh, no, okay. it's, for, it's made for a grandma. He can do it. Made yeah. for a grandma? If they're grandmas, we call them grandma straps. Okay. You just have to personally attack me all the time, don't you? What do you mean? Just call me, call me grandma. The other day I was guy on the lawn. <laughs> Old man on the lawn? Yeah. <laughs> got you going to get off my lawn guy? Yeah, yeah. Didn't even make sense. What do you mean? And you should go from because it's not gonna. It's difficult to stay right. This under. guy who's it never done it. Straight under. Yeah, because I have. I've got like engineering skills. It goes straight really? Under the tank. I do. And then you hold it like this. All right. Oh, I don't. Why aren't you guys doing that all the time? Because there's handles, Dad. Very hard. They both look like they're stumbling into place every time. <laughs> Cross it for me. You want it crossed? I cross it. I don't know. I don't now, want. I don't think I want to do it. Oh, yeah. You don't want to do it. Okay. But when all right, I'm get my belly. This is my point of view. I don't do the physical stuff. Oh, that's gonna get cut. I don't know. I've never done this before. You've never? I've never crossed it. Oh. And we did a big. Oh, that looks way better. It's it sits better and feels better on your neck. Once okay. Close. It actually looks like it's easy to work too once you're in place. Go ahead, man. Let's do it. Sam's still gonna trip. Get in there tight. I'll do it. Dude, if, if all you gotta do, honestly, because I like to build a better mouse trap, but each one of those things, if they went down and hooked to their own sides of the leg, it's money. All this this hook Yeah, but this unit is money. The fact that it's gotta go over to Mike is a flaw of it. Oh. <laughs> Try to bust it down in front of dad? Cause you'll actually see you lose the stability this way. Are you guys hearing me? No, what? That's nothing. Are you guys listening to me? <laughs> yeah. Absolutely not. It's unbelievable. <laughs> not a word. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna wish we're when I'm. I was wondering how much you were gonna keep talking. Well, because you know yeah. I can make this unit better <laughs> easily. It would be a double strap, but not. If it went down and connected to both legs, you no longer have to balance it like that. Ready? See, you have, you have to keep it. Wow, dude, that doesn't seem. Sam, look how easy you're working. I'd rather just carry it with him. Uh, I, of course you do, Nance. Yeah, I know. I know. I love you, Nance. Do you want? Do you want the fill there? No. I, just, I, I just. You see the dent on the backside? It's a temp tank, bro. I know. 
But that's why I wanted hidden. Go lay the dent on the back side. But dude, look at your front side, guy. <laughs> you, you threw this thing off a roof. I know. He's just gonna... Yeah, it's a temp tank, man. I just feel bad. He's look gonna... at this. Wow. <laughs> it's a temp tank. Alright. If you don't care, he sees that off his back deck. It's a temp yeah, tank, it's man. Good. It's, you know, I'm not gonna use a, a brand new tank. Right. That's why, Craig, you, you know, we thought we weren't gonna make payroll that week, but now I got a little money out of it. Dude, I'm going to say, if you push it all the way to the wall, two blocks is going to be... No work? You want it in? Yeah, yeah. No, wait, 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 wait for that. Come on, man. Oh, one block's going to be nice. Yeah. One block. Money. Ooh. Mikey, you got to flare this out here. Here, come in with me. You're gonna do it this way? This is how I do it. Coming at you. I want you to yeah, just do it really tight. Got it. My unit's already on it. Make it perfect. Okay. Right there. Oh my gosh. Okay. And you can pull. We're gonna do the inside first. All right. Got it. All right. And you, one of the reasons you know what what the problem with this is, it's got a 1,000 gallon tank. It takes 30 minutes to fill it every time. Inch and a quarter vent. Look at the head pressure he's building up on it. Three times a year for 30 minutes. Okay, we are. We are done here. We are done. So, the lines were hooked up. This was put through. Keep that closed. Uh, gonna figure that out. We gotta clean this up. That's it, ladies and gents. That'll hold up. Hey, I feel like one of our competitors doing a full brand new install. This is what their tanks look like. Right here. This is one of their good ones. Right, Sam? <laughs> this, this is a good install for, the, for them. Legs not painted. Yeah. Ah, the, the vent's far away from the window, so that'll work. Yep. Yeah. What? Connecting the tanks. What do you mean? The, the manifolds. Connect the manifolds to the bottom. Oh, yeah, we do a crossover and one on the bottom. Each of them have a firematic shutoff, which, honestly, you want my opinion? All you need is one 330 here. That's all you need. How long are you gonna be here? Right. Yeah, what are you going with manifold for then? Save your money. Here's the thing. When that tank, when I was lying on that, I at 900 gallons would have been faster. I could often go. I could probably on a good year with a wood stove go two years. Now that's not. Yes. Yeah, so you know, by my, my yeah. Cheap. Yeah. Let me just install one 330 there, because mm -hmm. then it'll fit. You know, it's not going to be over by here. It's not going to be by that. And um, I don't know. I'm here with the machine, man. Let me try to break these pads free, pull it away, level it, and use these pads. Yeah. Let me try. That's that's kind of exciting. Yeah, I'm trying to save you money, man. Yeah, I just took like three grand off your bill, I think. That's all you need. I'm going to revise it and resend it to you because I think you're already signed. Yeah, so I'm gonna send you a new one. Oh, well, the deposit will be, you know, a little bit. So you're paid. You're paid well then. Uh, you paid us well. So um, let me do that and save you some money. So I'm gonna revise it and shoot it to you. you want the original? 
No, that's no good anymore. Well, I mean, what? I thought that was self-explanatory. Well, somebody's got to get paid. Who's the somebody? Sam. <laughs> Sam, you do that. Write the invoice. This will officially be 1% of something we do. Oh, you carried the thing. So are, is, are we, was no. Kay Jesperson right? I mean, didn't that look so much easier? You know it did. And if you let yeah, me should. revise it to hold, to just slip little well, harnesses. Or, something. I think it's at the shop, it's yellow. Remember that little yellow? Yeah, dude, it's one thing that goes so to two. Just, just boom, just go down like this and go click, click well, with those. Why it will never be used most of the time is you gotta get it out, you gotta put it on, it takes five minutes. Or yeah, no, you're hanging up there. I'm just saying, I could make that thing so much better. And when it clicks around the legs, you could actually walk through a house with it. You got these two bad boys. There's nothing you'll ever be able to make that will compare to this. The loft, dude. That, that is this, no, this is the best you got. But I've, I've had, I've said, I've been saying I want to do that for how long? And I was stupid then. Maybe, you know. We are holding you back? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Right? Maybe I, I don't know. Um, Dude, my creative mind's gotta go. You gotta let me go. Go fly. Go ahead. You're yeah, I do. You gotta let me go, man. You just hold me back with your verbal abuse. Yeah. In one throw. Ducks fly together. Is that what we say? I don't know. Teamwork. Ready? One, two, three. Teamwork. teamwork. That sucked. Why did I say? It? <laughs> Never fell for it. I said teamwork. <laughs> I said it with you. Hey, there you go, Jim. That's why you're my favorite son. You say that a lot. No, just to cr Mike and Sam. <laughs> I just make sure I don't say it to you. Well, there it is, folks. <laughs> there is 98% of my competitors' installs right there. They're proud of that.